uh, this is Tamara. Are you having problems with people wanting what you have or are you wanting people to want what you have or buy what you're selling or whatever it is you're trying to attract people to, to, to get it? Well, here's how, what, what happens. Everybody doesn't communicate in the same way. You got some people who uh, communicate and they see words in their mind and you got other people that are more visual. They see pictures and they need pictures to actually get something. So what you have to do is you have to work with metaphors. If you think about something, for instance, I thought about this. What does uh, Joel Osteen, uh, Bishop T.D. Jakes, uh, Joyce Myers, and uh, Dr. Mike Freeman all have in common? Well, first of all, they're in ministry, but uh, the other thing is they tell stories. If you think about the books that Joel Osteen has written, most of his books, they tell about different testimonies and stories about different people where they had a problem and then they got a solution. And so people will remember stories, but they don't remember like, you know, the scripture or anything like that, but they remember how it made them feel or the, they got a visual of the story that was told that helped them to, you know, um, understand or accept what he was offering, which is he offers, you know, Jesus Christ, you know, as the Lord and Savior. In the end, that's the call to action to accept Jesus Christ, their Lord and Savior, because there's a benefit of it that they can get their problem solved. So he speaks to people's pain. And so if you're trying to get people to buy what you have or to want what you have, whether you're a hairstylist, a real estate agent, whatever it is, you've got to work with metaphors. You've got to tell stories and you've got to uh, solve uh, problems at the end of those stories. So think about that. If you got to study what, you know, those people do or how they have their call to action. The call to action is when you're getting people to, okay, make a commitment to either buy or, you know, get off the fence or whatever. But anyway, wanted to share that with you guys. And so I actually have a vehicle where if you're struggling, you know, in your business or whatever and you're wanting to get in front of masses of people and target them and you're wanting to share those things and you're tired of standing on your feet or you're tired of, you know, hitting the pavement or, you know, blaming the economy and all those kinds of things. You don't have a money problem you have a marketing problem it's the way that you're marketing so I have again I have a vehicle so if you're interested in finding out what that is and how it can um, help you in your life and your business go to www.makemoneywithtam.com click the link below if you didn't get that um, subscribe to my channel let's connect on Facebook I'm Tamara Glover Slayton and again um, if you're interested in you know learning more about how this works go there plug in your email address and get the information so I'll see you in the next post